Hi, I'm PJ Stahl, and I'm going to show you the thruster. For this movement pattern, it takes two movements and combines them together, the front squat and the shoulder press. So to, so to start out, set your feet a little wider than shoulder width, toes are pointed out slightly, about half an inch to an inch, because that's going to be your foundation, your strong squatting movement pattern. You're going to sit through your hips and stand up nice and tall. We're reaching up and putting our thumbs up on our shoulders and our elbows up here to simulate the front squat, so it's to, to simulate that racked movement pattern. It seems silly sometimes to do body weight exercises, but this is your chance as the instructor to watch the mobility and the movement patterns of your client. So you can really do an assessment of body weight when there's no chance of injury. Then you can progress your clients into weight. Thumbs on the shoulders, squat low. As you stand up, push your hands overhead every time. Squat, push, squat, push. The things I want you to watch for in your clients are elbows up, hip crease gets below the knee, and as you stand, full extension of the elbows at the top. I just don't want to see lazy arms. I want to see locked out every time. Push, push, full extension. That's the body weight version. We're going to go to the dowel next. For a dowel, I use a plastic PVC pipe that I've marked off to simulate the markings on an Olympic lifting bar. You can always use a broomstick or a wooden dowel. Whatever you use, just make sure it's unweighted. We're going to go through the same movement pattern. It's going to be thumbs distance from the inside tape line or thumbs distance from your shoulders if you have an unmarked bar. Come into your racked position here. Front squat first, then press overhead. Thruster, go. I want to see explosive hips every time you come out of the bottom. The point of this movement is to use your hips as you squat low to jump up almost and drive your arms overhead from the side. Every time, full front squat, full extension locked out. Let's go to the body bar and add some weight. Grabbing your bar, set the thumbs just outside of the shoulders. Feet are in your strong squatting position, toes pointed out slightly. Rack the bar in your front squat, thruster, go. Big push every time. Sit low through the hips, power as you push up and extend overhead. This is a full body movement pattern that's gonna work all of your clients' legs, arms. If you pick up the pace, they're gonna get cardio in there as well. This is a great movement to incorporate into your class. I'll see you again next time.